Uh, I was invited by Congressman Cummings from Maryland to serve uh, on the panel uh, for the Congressional Black Caucus Foundation uh, meeting. Uh, the panel was on education, and uh, Secretary of Education Duncan uh, was on it, uh, along with uh, six black uh, congressmen, uh, Congress people, uh, and uh, there were two advocacy groups and uh, one person in an after-school program. Um, there was about a 30-second, which was about two-minute, uh, discussion of um, our, our general viewpoint uh, and then an open discussion of uh, led by the moderator. Um, my point was about the importance of development. Uh, Secretary Duncan laid out what they were doing. Uh, and I think most of the Congress people were concerned about real life issues, not so much about education, but how education would help solve those problems. And their concern was about the cradle to pipeline uh, uh, to cr cradle to prison pipeline problem. Um, the fact that uh, too many black young people were not prepared for the workforce and uh, family problems and a whole series of issues that had to do with um, uh, the well functioning of the African American community and thinking about how education uh, should serve the community. And so, what I was trying to show was that we needed an education uh, where attention was given to development so that uh, our young people can um, manage not only academic issues, but all of the challenges and tasks uh, that they're expected to uh, be able to handle as adults. My hope uh, is that uh, the Department of Education, particularly in the area of uh, teacher quality, uh, but also early childhood, uh, will really uh, begin to uh, infuse the developmental sciences into the uh, programs that they are uh, creating. Uh, we can create a number of programs, and we have over the years, that uh, spend a lot of money but did not address the developmental issues. Uh, and that's the problem, that there are a disproportionate number of young people in uh, African American community for historical reasons, uh, poor uh, communities uh, and other groups that have been marginalized, a uh, disproportionate number of young people who do not receive the support for development they need to be successful uh, in school. And therefore the school has to address that. Education has to address it. Uh, education uh, has to prepare teachers and administrators and, and policy makers from the very beginning to think development and, and use it uh, in uh, providing young people the kind of culture they need in school uh, that will support their development so that they can perform uh, adequately.